Hello, welcome to the 14th annual LD Micro main event in Beverly Hills. I'm here with Ken Scarens of Brainchip, uh, BRCHF on the OTC markets. Uh, Ken, would you like to tell us a little bit more about the company? Sure. Uh, our company is a artificial intelligence semiconductor company. We are manufacturing a chip and selling licensing IP that will specialize in artificial intelligence for edge devices. So what kind of stuff are you working on that uh, investors should look forward to over the next coming years? Sure. So what we're doing is we are taking advantage of a movement in the industry where um, artificial intelligence processing is moving out of data centers and to edge devices. And so an edge device might be something uh, like an autonomous driving system in a car. It could be a drone. It could be a, a satellite uh, doing imagery. Um, it could be something like your Google Home or an Alexa. And so what we're trying to do is help that movement where AI will now be processed immediately on the device rather than sending that information through the cloud to a data center, um, having it processed there and then sent back to the device. Interesting. Yeah. Now, I know there's been, a, this last year, a lot of disruptions in the, the mining of uh, specific materials used for chips and stuff like that. Have you incurred any uh, interruptions there? Uh, we have been fortunate. We have got a, a great uh, manufacturing partner, a company called Socionext, um, that has helped um, and, and uh, handled the manufacturing aspect of it with uh, Taiwan Semiconductor. And so because of um, Socionext uh, being such a um, a powerhouse in the industry. We have so far been immune to that. Um, part of our business model also is that we are hoping to license our intellectual property. Um, so uh, we will probably, um, that will probably become a, a bigger part of our business than selling actual silicon, although we will do that. But um, we will be able to navigate through that. Um, I know that's expected to last another year or so. Um, so we think we'll be able to weather that storm pretty well. Excellent. And what's the competition look like in the space? It's um, it's just starting to um, to to show up. It's a, it's an interesting industry because we are disrupting an industry that doesn't exist yet. <laughs> so we're we are disrupting artificial intelligence at the edge. Um, there's some some of the big guys are in this uh, business as well. Um, Intel, um, most notably, has just released the second version of their chip, which is. It's still a research chip, and it's it's still a few years from being commercialized. Mm -hmm. um, so we still have a, a bit of a lead over them, um, but they are a giant. Um, IBM's in this business. They will continue investing heavily in this sector. Um, so we know we have to work hard and continue investing to stay ahead. Interesting. Does your tech uh, play into uh, quantum computing at all? Ooh, that one is <laughs> that one's a little over my head. Um, I not to my knowledge, we are um, we are not uh, into anything in the quantum computing realm. Um, we are kind of sticking to edge AI. Edge so, AI. Yeah. Awesome. So, is there anything else you'd like the investors to know about? Um, I think uh, just to keep an eye on our, our business, we are going to be releasing our first um, chip uh, this uh, Q four uh, over the next couple of months. Um, we are also going to be uh, releasing a development kit that um, developers will be able to use to evaluate our technology. Um, and we are just really just kind of launching our whole commercialization strategy right now. So it's a big moment in our history. Um, and so we think uh, this is the time to, to keep an eye on us and, uh, and to get involved if you're not already. Awesome. All right. Well, we have Brainship. Thank you for joining us, Ken. Thank you very much. Enjoy the event. Thank you. Thank you.